goal? Is it worth it? Is it worth it for you to stop eating out to be able to save the money to reach your goal? Would that be worth it for you? It would, but it comes with a sacrifice. I yes. Imagine, oh, imagine no, 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 that. No, 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 but what I'm saying is like, I don't have like a mini fridge all day. You don't need a mini fridge. But I'm never, at like, I would always be like, I'm always on the go. So uh huh. The food's gonna go bad. No, it's not. What kind of food do I eat? <laughs> <laughs> Your food's not gonna go bad in the car for 12 hours, right? Do you see how hot it is? Like, yeah, it's hard to keep it warm. I mean, here's how you do it. Here's how you do it. Now, pay attention, you guys, because all the excuses are gonna come. And this is what all of you do every single time you think about doing this. But you see, what if sacrifices? Oh my god, it's so hot, my oh, food's gonna die. It's not gonna do that. That's not how food works. That's not how food works, okay? Especially once you've been seasoned and cooked, it's not gonna be raw meat, right? You're gonna cook your meat, right? Okay, as long as you have raw meat in the car, you're good, right? Nothing with eggs, whatever. But here's how it works I do this. I have a one of those little cold bags. One of those little cold bags have a little mini, uh, mini what you call it, two of those little, little tiny little coolers. That I keep in my car. Number one, sometimes I just want some cold water. Sometimes I want something cold. I keep ice in there and I keep cold stuff in there. Especially when I'm gonna be gone all day. I like to have my yogurt, I like to have my whatever. I just keep my shit in there. Cause I get hungry. I snack a lot. You know what I mean? FedEx. So I snack a lot. So I like my stuff to be cold. And it doesn't have to be cold, doesn't have to be cold. Then the car keeps it warm. Aha. So now the car is an oven for the things that need to stay warm. And you have a little cooler for the things that need to stay cool. Here's the thing. When you make a decision, when you create a system, you have to trust your system. Guys will do this a lot when you guys are bodybuilding, working out, like, yo, I need my protein, I need my shake, I need this, you guys carry your shaker bottles, you've got your, you know, and you do it, you make it work, because you want your muscles. That's what's important, you value that, right? So when you value something, you do whatever it takes to make that shit happen, no matter what. And you don't come up with excuses. And you don't worry about the sacrifices because you value that shit. So you do it. You do it every day until you get your muscles. And you're buying hundred dollar bottles of whey protein, and you're all you do. And you guys, the, the boys are smiling because they know what I'm talking about. And you do this shit because it's important to you. Because you've been a bird chest your whole life, and now you want to get some girls. <laughs> Wow! Your whole theory just went 
before, but Monday through Thursday, so I could cheat Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And what I spent was $26 Monday morning at Winco. It was a bag of Brussels sprouts and asparagus that's chopped up and diced. Okay. Two boxes of uh, lean turkey. Yes. And... Uh, <coughs> oh, you see this? Cold, bro. Guys, <laughs> it keeps everything cold. Go ahead. I'm, I'm impressed already. Right. Oh, and uh, four sweet potatoes. That's one of the last one. Four sweet potatoes. Nice. Yeah, that's the, that's the ground turkey with Brussels sprouts. Ground sprouts. turkey, Brussels sprouts, asparagus, seasoned. 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 It's like taco seasoning. Yeah, exactly. Nice. Yeah, so. Nice and warm. It's nice and warm, too, because, like, how is it still warm? I just ate it. I just heated it up in the cafeteria. Wow, imagine that. <laughs> there's, four, there's four microwaves in the cafeteria. There are four microwaves in the cafeteria. You don't say. All right, what's in the other part? And I said $26 because. You look at that, bro. <laughs> you got a little oh, green and got a box of these cookies. And just got a few cookies, and they got M&Ms in them. They're cute, right? And that's it. Oh, oh and you got your suja? Oh, I'm getting a little fancy. I've never tried that. Love a suja. Probiotic. I haven't tried the probiotic. Either apple cider vinegar juice, lemon cayenne. This is going to be awesome for your immune and for your digestion. It's going to move all of that out of yeah, you. Oh, 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 if you go home. <laughs> No, after this class, I'm going to heat it up again, go study, to the library clothes, and I'm going to eat this again tomorrow. And that's tomorrow? Yeah. You have some left over for tomorrow? I got two more of those in the fridge right now. And, and for $26? $26. So for $26, you ate, you're going to eat for how many days? Two days? Uh, no, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday? And Thursday. And Thursday. For $26, this very smart gentleman is eating for four days. I swear to God, you would have thought I had planted him here. He knew exactly what I was talking about. How, how amazing is this? For $26. You're going to spend $45 today, tomorrow, and for those four days. So you're going to spend 45 times four, which is basically a billion dollars. <laughs> and he's going to eat healthier than you, which means he's going to have better skin than you, which means he's going to have better hair than you, which means his muscles are happier than your muscles, which means he's probably going to sleep better than you, Start your new life. You are going to 